Damn. Damn. Guys, did you just see this spike? Just look at this. Damn. Guys, this is an, this is an awesome strategy. You know, it is very, very awesome. I don't want to lie, though. It is very, very awesome. I just entered right here. And, and then it was only this tick and this one. Then, boom, it went all the way up, guys. And with only 0, 0,20, you know. I just didn't want to risk a lot, you know. I just wanted to show you guys, like, how easy it is. You know, um, guys, you know, um, I'm using these small world sizes on purples, you know. Why on purples? To show the people with small accounts, like, how... Uh, how will they be able to grow a ten dollar account? Yeah, you know, you know that um I'm always testing the the strategies on my demo accounts, right? You know that. Um, but here I was just show, I was just showing people with um small accounts. Maybe you know people usually start their accounts with ten dollars. You know, people who have accounts of ten dollars. Um, I was just showing them that they can be able to do it too. You know, guys like. Damn, another one. <laughs> you see? You see, guys? It's like it is so easy, though. I'm doing this on purpose. Just imagine if you got... um, Just like on my previous video, I, I, um, I made um, $8 too with 0, 0,20. So just imagine if you got a $10 account. You are new to this. You know, you're trying to grow your account. And then you use the minimum lot size, which is the minimum, which is the lot size that you're going to use no matter what. And then you get the spike, guys. Two spikes, just like the ones that I got right here. And then you make, maybe you two, obviously you're going to take one trade, not two trades. You take um one trade, then you got $8 profit. Guys, you have made 80% plus of your account with your first trade. Damn, guys, this is so awesome. You see, it is it is very powerful. It is so easy. This strategy it is so easy, but yet it is so powerful, guys. Yo, yo, what's up, YouTube? Guys, you know, um, this is a new strategy, guys. You know, I'm back with a new strategy. I'm back with the bangers, you know. I don't want this video to be too long because I even got um a live trade, too. You know, starting from right now, um, I'm not really saying on every video, but then... On most of my videos, I'm going to show you guys the live trades. You know, most people do videos and then they do not show you guys the live trades. You know, how did they catch the spikes or how did they catch the ticks? You know, but then me guys, you know, I like doing it because it becomes so easy. You know, it is better than showing you um, the past. You know, how did the strategy work, you know, on the past? So... Showing you the, the the present or the current thing, it will be better than showing you the um the the um the past one. So I'm going to attach my live trade using this strategy, guys. You know. So let's get straight to how the strategy works. Anyways, I'm going to show you all the settings of the strategy at the end of the video. So let's get to how the strategy works. You see this is your chart, right? So what you have to do, you zoom one, two, you zoom twice. And then what you just have to do, it is to, um, 
I'm just looking for an opportunity. Um, oh, let me go to the one that I just took right now. The one that I just took. Guys, you wait for this blue moving average. This one. Let me, um, yeah, I hope you can see it. This blue moving average. To cross with this um to cross with this oscillator though this blue moving average this one you wait for it to cross with this this is boom right you wait for this blue moving average to cross this you know as soon as it crosses it and then you get um these some sort of ticks you get them on top of your moving average you know just wait for about one or two ticks and then you just click your buy then you're going to get the profit guys you see it is so easy it is so easy guys just look at it you wait for this blue moving average to cross with this oscillator you know passing this zero level going downwards and then you wait for about two to two, two to three ticks, and then you click your buy. You know, let's say it crossed here, as you can see, and then you wait for one, two, three ticks, and then you buy here. You know, it was lost for about one, two, three, four minutes, and then boom, there was your spike, guys. It is so easy. Like, it is so easy. Another one, guys. You wait for this blue moving average, this one, this blue moving average, to cross with this oscillator, you know, to so cross with this, you know, there you go. You can see that it went down and then it crossed with this oscillator. As soon as it crosses, you wait for about two to three ticks. One, two, three. And then you clicked your buy around here. You didn't even wait. Boom. There's your spike, guys. You see, it is super easy. Another one, guys, like it is so easy, but it is so powerful. I swear, guys, you know, but I would like you guys to use it on your demo first. Why? Just so that you get you guys can get used to it, you know, because most of these strategies, you know, they don't want you guys just to go straight to your real account and use it and only to find out you're not really familiar with it you know you do not really know the conditions that much you know so it would be easier if you guys test it on your demo account first and then you can take it to your real account as time goes on you know the more you get familiar with it so let's go guys um this blue moving average it came down it came down and then it crossed with this oscillator after it crosses with the oscillator you wait for about two to three candlesticks this is your one two three and then you waited for only this tick and then boom and then again guys just look at it it is so powerful it is so easy it is not any complicated but then guys it is so powerful i swear it is so powerful there you go again this blue moving average crossed with this oscillator it crossed with this oscillator you see they crossed and then you wait for about two to three candlesticks um let's say it's one two three and then you waited for only one two three ticks and then boom you see guys all the way up all the way up you see it's easy guys let me show you on crash though it's already six minutes let me show you on crash you know just the last two examples let's say right here hope you guys can see though this blue moving average it crossed with this oscillator you know this time it goes above the zero level it crossed with this oscill um, oscillator and then you wait for only about two to three ticks. You see, like it came up, then they crossed, they crossed, they crossed. As soon as it gets to the top, you wait for only two to three ticks. One, two, three, and then boom. You see, boom, there it is. A long, long spike. 
let's look at the last example there it is guys you wait for this blue uh, moving average to cross with this os um, oscillator and then as soon as they cross this is your cross right this is your cross right here and then you wait for two to three ticks let's see this was your cross then you wait for two to three ticks one two three and then you enter right here right here you enter right here and then you waited for only one tick and then boom you see guys it is super awesome it is so easy that's what i love you know it is not complicated even people who are new to to this market or people who are new to the boom and crash are going to be able to use it you know guys and just imagine it contains only two indicators this is the last example guys um you see this oscillator and this moving average they crossed this blue moving average crossed with those um, oscillator going upwards and then this was your cross right this was your cross here right here no here here and then you wait for two to three ticks let's see one two three and then you waited for one two being in loss and then boom it went all the way down guys you sell you sell you know you sell so in this case it is the opposite you're going to sell on crash you're going to buy on boom thank you guys no no no, no. oh my god uh, oh excuse me i almost forgot about the settings let, let me show you the settings guys um the first it is a um accelerate house calculator which is the line width it is four pixel and then the value up the color you can make it green the value down the color is red you can make it your own color though and then the moving average still under the indicator window one do not edit on the main chart click on this f button on indicator window one and then the moving average we got period 10 0 exponential close and then the style is two pixel the color is blue there it is guys thank you guys i'm out